In this video, we will learn to fix Far Cry 5 error msvcp100.dll is missing. So let's begin. Go in the description, and there will be a link to this page that is www.dll-files.com, and the heading says Download msvcp100.dll. Once you are redirected on this page, just scroll down below. In here, just go and download first the 32-bit version and then the 64-bit version. And you have to take care that the versions of both the file 32-bit and 64-bit is the same. So just go and download both of these files. First the 32-bit file, that is msvcp100.dll 32-bit file. And here the download will start in few moments. So the download has completed. Now just go and download the 64-bit file. So here the download will also start in few moments. So the download has completed. First of all, you have to check what kind of system we have, whether it's 64-bit or 32-bit. For that, just go to your this PC, right-click it, and here click on properties. And again, the system type, you can see what kind of system you have. Is it 64-bit or 32-bit? So I have 64-bit operating system. So just go and close that. Now, just go to your download folder where we have just downloaded the msvcp100.dll files. Here, just go and first extract the 32-bit file. Extract it here. Now, just go and extract the 64-bit file. Once we have extracted both the files, first we would solve the system for 32-bit. For that, just go and open the 32-bit folder, open that, and copy the DLL file, copy it. Just go to your this PC, go to local disk C, go to Windows folder, and here just scroll down below and search for system32. Just scroll down below and here we have system32, just go and open that, and paste the 32-bit DLL file here. Paste it here, click continue go back the problem for 32 bit operating system has been solved now we will solve the problem for 64 bit operating system for that just go and copy the 64 bit dll file copy the 64 bit dll file copy it and again go to your windows folder that we have just opened now just go and again open the system 32 open the system 32 and paste the 64-bit DLL file here. Paste it here and click continue. Go back. Now just go and copy the 32-bit DLL file. Copy it and again go to your Windows folder and here just scroll down below and search for SysWow64. Here we have SysWow64. Just go and open that and here paste the 32-bit DLL file we have just copied. Paste it here. Click continue. So now the problem for 64-bit has also been solved. If you still have any confusion where to copy and where to paste just go and go back to your video and hope the problem will be solved. If you still have any confusion just comment down below I will try to answer that. But before you go please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.